What's up, beloved? So, uh, Meryl said you're going to be tested, right? To see how far you've, so you, for you to see how far you've come, right? Um, just basically to put everything that you've learned in, uh, into action, right? Um, and to, for you to notice that you've learned and passed these, actually passed these tests, right? So, for example, okay, I had some uh, old neighbor come over, right, the other day, yesterday, right? Uh, actually, it was a few few friends, right? It's old neighbor and a few friends that he's hang out, right? They came over to chill last night, right? And we're just sitting here chilling and watch TV, talking and whatever. And one of them was, was intoxicated, okay, and, which was the old neighbor, okay? There were three white guys, right? And I'm telling you why this matters, okay? Um, and we're sitting there talking, right? And this neighbor used to always, like, they're over-sexualized or something, right? So everything that came out of their mouth, it was always of a sexual nature, right? It was always vulgar, you know? It was uncomfortable, to be around, you know what I'm saying? So, it wasn't like that at first, okay? We're all talking, chilling, or whatever, and then there this person goes with the over, you know, telling stories and all this, and I'm just like, here we go again, right? And so, I, I just let it slide for a second, okay? Until I started to feel uncomfortable, right? <laughs> Mind you, we're in my own house, okay? And he knows better. Okay, and then he said something about some black dudes that he's met or whatever, and he he made he said uh, he made a joke about something about he couldn't remember the names of the black folks that he had met, right? Two to two on my time. He couldn't remember the black the names of the black folks that he had met. Right, but it was a reference. It was a racial reference to black folks' names. Right, the type of names that we that some of us have. Right, and my name is Leon. It's just really it's a typical name. Right, but he was referring to you know name black names that that are not the average name. Right, and I'm looking at him like <laughs> I won't say what I said in my head, but I'm like. He's laughing, and then the other two are looking at me, and I'm looking at him. I'm like, I'm like, that's racist, you. Oh, I said you asshole, but you know, excuse me. Man. I'm like, that's racist, you, you, you know. So, I'm like, are you serious right now? I'm like, get up, get out of my house, right? So I kicked him out. But that was a test, <laughs> right? That was a, a form of a test, right, to see. What would I put up with? You know what I'm saying? And especially in my own in my own space, right? So I immediately kicked them out, right? I'm like, dude, get get up, get out before I come across your jaw. I'm just saying, like that's how I was feeling at the time. Get up, get out before I come across. <laughs> get up. And then and then he acted like he like like I was tripping, like uh, I was making a big deal out of, and I explained to him. Right, not that I needed to, but I explained to him how disrespectful he was. Okay, and he knows this. See, when he's sober, he's fine, but when he's intoxicated, them spirits, okay, them demons, they come to the surface and get to get to doing this. <laughs> not in my house. No, absolutely not. So look, this is funny. <laughs> One of the white dudes that was sitting in the in the chair, right? The, the one I'm talking about was sitting on the floor, but the other white dude was sitting in the chair. He saw my temperament changing. <laughs> so it, it it was funny because like the demons that he must have had in him, right? He got up quick as when my temperament changed before I was kicking him out. He got up quick and and left <laughs> before I had told you know dude to leave. He got up quick and left because he saw my temperament changing already. He's like, this dude's about to 
beat his, you know, and, uh, and I'm like, he knows better, right? <laughs> so the spirits in him was like, uh-uh, uh-uh, right? Because I can feel the environment shifting when he was doing that, right? So I shifted it back, okay? Manipulated that energy back, right? And pushed it on out of my front door, you know what I'm saying? So that was a form of test that I had to go through, right? To see how far that I've come, right? To see that I don't put, not that I put up with that before, absolutely not. You know, tell no racist jokes in front of me and, and, and I'm not gonna say nothing, right? But the patience that I had for him before, I have for people no more, right? So that was just a form of test that I had went through to show me, right, that how much I've changed, five by five my timer, right? So, significant change, see, there we go. So, um, you're gonna be tested in those type of ways, right? It's like the final, you know, it's like the last final few tests that you go through before you exit where you are, okay? So, just be aware of that, okay? These will be occurring, all right? Um, I wasn't even gonna tell that story, right? But Holy Spirit said, get up there and, and Get up there and tell them what happened and tell them the story, right? I was like, all right. So, that's it, <laughs> all right? I love y'all, beloved, all right? I pass y'all tests, okay? All right, later, peace.